2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. here on 2K Sports for NBA Basketball. Hi, everybody. This is Brian Anderson. And with me tonight, Grant Hill and Steve Smith, our reporter, Allie LaForce. Allie, take it away. Hey, Brian, you could say the alley-oop is perhaps the game's most exciting play. Ricky Rubio said that 80% of the credit should go to the finisher. LeBron James said, quote, the worst passes often lead to the best finishes. And Lonzo Ball said, when you have someone you trust to catch it, you can pretty much throw it wherever. Oh, yeah, he's had some good ones, Allie. Thanks. Let's take a look at the numbers for Andrew Wiggins. And he's gone cold over the last 10 games, guys. His scoring numbers are down, and he can't seem to get out of this rough patch. He's got to get himself going tonight, or they'll start losing patience with him. All right, checking out Golden State's opening lineup. The core of the dynasty all out there. Splash Brothers in the backcourt with Draymond at four. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Wiseman. And for New Orleans, Zion at power forward with Valanchunas at center. Devontae Graham out there with Thomas Sadoransky. And it's Ingram in at the three slot. And Grant, how often do players check in on their own stats during a season? B.A., everybody in the league watches their numbers. Some guys are just willing to admit it. Tip-off goes to New Orleans. Pass to Sadoransky. Outside Graham. Here's Williamson. They get it back. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Whether it be rebounding, driving the ball, in transition, Zion always looking to attack. Wiggins outside. Got a piece of it. And here is Williamson. He had nine points in his last time out. Green against Valanchunas. Here's Ingram. Count it. One for one to start the game. This is just a case of Brandon Ingram getting stronger and more able to play through contact. Curry passes to Green. Off the mark there with a three. For New Orleans, they've gone two of three to get this one going. Here's Valanchunas. And a great assist by Graham as that one goes. That's Valanchunas' game. Beat you with size and power. Takes the contact and completes the play. Here's Wiseman. The shot from the low post is good. Excellent timing on that play and a wonderful pass. Graham against Curry from 11 feet away. Misses off the left iron. The Warriors have gone one of three from the floor to the paint. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. Oh, he really fought for that one. Battling through contact to complete the play. At the line for the Warriors, James Wiseman. At the line for one. Pelicans have gone three of five shooting so far. Pass to Ingram. Williamson with it. That shot missing. Green with the defensive effort. Golden State with the ball. They trail by one. 
when you talk about beyond the box score, Draymond is the prime example. So much of his contributions don't show up in his numbers. Now here's Williamson, a real weapon on offense, averaging around 24 and a half a game. Graham finds Ingram. To the middle. Here's Williamson. Can't get it to drop. The Warriors go the other way with it. The leadership, the communication. Draymond does so much, Smitty. You know, B.A., he's a unique player in that regard. List the level of everyone on his team. A true coach on the floor. Down low. Here's Ingram. Soft touch off the glass. A prime example of Sadoransky's feel and vision for the game is making it easy for his teammates. Pass to Green. And here's Curry. From downtown, buries it from three. It's a tie three. ball game. You don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Valanciunas with it, guarded by Wiseman. Now Williamson. Shot clock at five. Graham for three. Warriors with the rebound. Last time they met in San Francisco. And they got into a consistent offensive flow, largely because the defense they were facing was poor. Yeah, it seemed like they got every shot they wanted. I'm sure they wish every game could be that way. Curry with a steal. Pass to Green for the finish. And it's hammered home by Green. Incredible hand-eye coordination of Steph Curry. Shows up in his dribbling, but also when he's out there still in the rock. Now here's Williamson. Here's Valanciunas. Outside Graham. Six on the shot clock. Outside Ingram. To halt the run. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Valanciunas. And now let's turn to the 2K leaderboard for a look at the squads that have the most points in transition over the past 10 games. The Warriors, number one. Second, the Pelicans. And during the last 10 games of the season, both of these squads have focused more on leaking out and capitalizing in transition. We'll see if they're able to maintain this pace moving forward. No question, this offense has some firepower. <laughs> and they're looking very confident in all that they're doing right now. Wiggins, left side. And it's good. Oh, Assisting really? on the play was Curry. Curry's got his fourth assist with that last one. New Orleans calls timeout. Talk Orleans. to anyone who has guarded Curry. They all talk about his movement. He never stops moving on offense. All right, look who's coming to the court. Come on, get up and get down. to Sadoransky. Williamson, right side. Knocks it loose. Thompson with a steal. To the inside. Sadoransky with the steal. It's stolen by Green. Thompson outside. Pass to Wiggins. Shot clock at six. 
Yes, it's good. Wiggins got five. So polished from this painted area. Love watching Wiggins do his thing close to the basket. Ingram with the ball. Back to Graham. Williamson inside. Hounded by Wiggins. And Williamson gets it to go. Because of Zion's strength and explosiveness, he's nearly unguardable around the rim. Outside, Green. Chalk up two there. Green's got his third basket on the night right there. <laughs> Their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. And here's Ingram from the arc. Clay Thompson pulls down the board. Okay, that's frustrating. You work hard to get these open looks. You know he liked that one back. Shot is up. And the Warriors get it back. Good on the shot. James He's White. got seven. And this defense needs to turn the screws and ramp up the intensity. They're looking a little loose out there right now. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Pass to Ingram. High post, Valanchunas. Williamson outside. Sadoransky outside. Shoots over Thompson. Sadoransky shot is off. Missed opportunity. It's a makeable shot for him. He just can't get it to go. Counted. And the Warriors lead by 13. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. New Orleans calls timeout. Their last game, a win against the Suns. Looking to carry it into this one. Yeah, and that one came down to their rebounding. There was a big gap between the two teams there. And you know this, what you do on the backboard may not completely win or lose a game, but it can tip the scale in one team's favor. Warriors making a change here. So it's the Pelicans now. It's a 13-point game. Graham against Curry. Pass to Alexander Walker. Thompson with a steal. And again, it's Golden State. And now we'll get a perspective here on how the hustle game has been going for the Warriors. Their aggressiveness on D has been the most glaring aspect of this game so far. They have the heat turned all the way up in this first half. The other thing that's been effective so far tonight is their fast break. A lot of points coming on the run. Now here's Thompson coming off a solid outing against Dallas. Pass to Curry. Now here's Bielitsa. Here's Toscano. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Here's Alexander Walker. 4-3. And another three for New Orleans. Their defense has to do a better job of smothering those shooters. Graham against Curry. And that one's good. That makes him two for three. And force feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. Here's Alexander Walker. Nine points in his last outing. Outside Graham. And another. 
Another three for New Orleans. That's the pass you want. Orchestrating the offense, creating for others. Now Thompson. He's been a big scorer for this offense. Averaging around 20 points a game. And Clay Thompson picks up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. Temple's checked in for Graham. For New Orleans, they've gotten 8 of 16 attempts to fall. Here's Alexander Walker. Right now, contributing around 10.5 points a game. Temple. Inside. Here's Hayes. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. I know it's early, but you have to wonder if these offenses can keep this up. Yeah, both teams in the zone early. Stops have been almost impossible to come by. Now here's Thompson. Pass to Bielitsa. In the first two Over Aaron on Gomez. The shot by Bielitsa, no good. Empty possession, and you don't want to miss these easy looks. And it's Alexander Walker penetrating, and they pick up two. Now just a four-point Warrior lead. Golden State has gone two of five from beyond the arc in the first quarter. 133 left in the first quarter of the game. Pass to Curry. Just five to shoot. Pelican five. Nikita Alexander Walker. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Substitution for the Warriors. Kevon Looney. Otto Porter. A minute 22 left in the first quarter here. Curry finds Thompson. Six to shoot. Looney up top. 13 feet out. The shot no good. And New Orleans will go the other way with it. Boy, the offense has been on point. <laughs> they have great timing and great communication. So hard to get stops against them. Now here's Curry. He also had a big impact in that win against the Mavericks. Pass to Thompson. A shot to stop the drought. Drops in the three. Thompson's got five. Woo, what range from Clay Thompson. It's insane. Combine that with this confidence, it's a lethal concoction. Here's Temple. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Here's Murphy. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. And what's working here, each guy is willing to make the next pass. Seven-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Porter. This one for three. And the Warriors with another three. Big time answer. Porter unwilling to give an inch. Knocks down a three of his own. Here's Alexander Walker. He's got five. Three pointer. Draymond Green has been on display for the Golden State Warriors. Eight points in the quarter, showing how effective he can be. And don't go far. We'll be right back. We've seen the development of Andrew Wiggins in Golden State. He says it's been a great environment to learn. The rest of our team love to teach. The good player, they're always telling us why we did it, why you should do this, why you should do that. So it's been a lot of learning and also been very exciting uh, for the young players. Brad Wiggins seems to be taking that next step. Yes, he is. I mean, the former number one overall pick. With a fresh start, some of that pressure is off. Doesn't have to be a star. His best is good enough. Hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. And what do you guys think about the Warriors here in this one? 
Well, so far, they've got things rolling along nicely at the offensive end. This is exactly what you want to see if you're a coach. Your team starting fast and playing with confidence. They've got Jackson Hayes. He's out there with Willie Hernan Gomez. And it's Alexander Walker in at the shooting guard position. That's the Pelicans five. The first thing that comes to mind when you're talking about Clay Thompson is shooting. But his post play is fantastic. A great way for him to take advantage of mismatches. Here's Temple. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. A great job to establish position and square up. First team foul. Here's Curry. Pass to Toscano. And here is Thompson. Fires the three. Alexander Walker grabs a board. And the post play is something Clay has worked on. Makes sense with his height and size. Working inside out, also a benefit for Clay. He is much more than just a shooter. Here's Temple. Down to five on the shot clock. Let's it fly. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. They come into this one having outplayed the Mavericks last time out. And we all know that on the road, you don't usually look so comfortable on the offensive end. But that was the story of the game. Yeah, they look right at home. Except they weren't. Great job of blocking out the noise. Here's Alexander Walker. The Warriors getting their last shot to go. And Grant, you played almost two decades in the league. What do you think some of the biggest highlights in your career were? Really just, you know, playing on some great teams with great players. Uh, the relationships, the experiences. I didn't win an NBA championship. Uh, but I am more than blessed with having an incredible 19-year career. Shooting two. First free throw is good. The Pelicans making a switch here. Ingram's checked in. And Golden State also making a switch. Wiggins, he's checked in for Klay Thompson. It's both from the stripe. We're about a minute and a half into the second quarter. Pass to Toscano. Outside Curry. Here's Wiggins. Here's Porter. Perfect night so far. Two for two. Hard to shake Porter's focus. Good at staying in control on the way up. Quarter two and about two minutes in. Now here's Hernan Gomez. He's defended by Looney. Clock at six. Let's it go from 14. Alexander Walker with the bucket. Alexander Walker's got four points this quarter. Easy look for mid-range. He won't miss many of those. Lazy effort defensively. Pass to Toscano. Porter against Ingram. Here's Toscano. Again, the One Warriors Toscano score. Anderson. The complete game of Otto Porter. Overplay him, and it's a good bet he'll find the open band. Here's Ingram. He's guarded by Porter. Ingram with the ball. Looney's there. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. Almost converts despite the contact. You know, we've seen guys get traded, become the guy for a team, and excel. One example is Brandon Ingram going to New Orleans as the piece in the Anthony Davis deal in the summer of 2019. Shooting two.
the first free throw is good. During his first year in the Big Easy, Ingram thrived as the focus of the Pelicans' offense, named to his first All-Star game. And at just 22 years old, B.A., it wasn't just Ingram averaging over 23 points per game. It was his 39% shooting from deep, also throwing in about six rebounds and four assists per game. Brandon made a statement in his first year in New Orleans that he can be a franchise player in this league. Both free throws good from Ingram. He's living there tonight, a tough guy to guard without fouling. And the bonus, he's going to knock him down. To the middle. And there's Green on the assist from Curry. Curry's got his seventh assist here tonight. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Here's Temple. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. From 13, count it. Terrific use of his body to open up space on the inside. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes played. Curry passes to Wiggins. Pass to Wiseman. Now Curry, six to shoot. And stolen by Williamson. To the inside. Stolen by Wiggins. Here's Green. Rebounded by New Orleans. Williamson's got four rebounds in the game. Here's Temple. He's covered by Curry. And it's Temple missing. Might like a duel over there. Quality look inside. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It'll be on Zion Williamson. And really, credit Green for getting the favorable position down inside, forcing the D's hand there. Taking two shots. Free throw good. Green. One of the great second-round picks of the modern age. What Draymond contributes is somewhat irreplaceable. Graham's checked in for the Pelicans. And both free throws good for Green. The Pelicans have gone 2 of 4 here in the second quarter. Pass to Williamson. Now here's Ingram. He takes it in. And he knocks it down. He's 3 of 5 now from the floor. A wiry guy with great body control. Ingram can adjust in the face of good defense. Porter with it. He's coming off a 13-point game against Dallas. Wiggins passes to Wiseman. Six on the shot clock. And here's Porter outside. Valanchunas with a rebound. New Orleans has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. Here's Williamson. Good on the shot, and that changed the lead to single digits. Williamson's got his third bucket of the night. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. Graham against Curry. The three ball. The shot that time, not on target. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. Here's Ingram. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Zion Williamson. That's foul number two for him. This speaks to Ingram's confidence. He knows he has this shot in his bag. And some changes here for the Warriors. Mielita comes in for Green. And it's Kaminga in for Porter Jr. The Warriors leading. Outside Curry. Pass to Kaminga. And here's Wiseman. Up top Curry. Down low. From seven. Count that bucket. Bielitsa's got his first two points of the night. And he's been an ideal teammate tonight. He's really creating plenty of looks with his passing. There has been an emphasis on ball movement. And he's been a major catalyst. Now here's Sadoransky. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. 
New Orleans needs to hurry. Late clock. Here's Williamson. He drains it as the shot clock ticks down. You know, they're really being bullied right now defensively. Eight of the last ten points have come from inside. With some arc. And a nice layup by Curry. Curry's got seven points in the game. We talk about his three-point shot, but I think his floater is just as good. Pass to Williamson. Now here's Ingram. 18 feet out. He hits the back iron and sinks it. Ingram's got eight points in the quarter. He's really finding his rhythm here. I mean, smart move to keep feeding him the ball. Let him decide whether to shoot it, whether to pass it. He's your catalyst right now. Adds to their lead. They've been able to rely on him all night. Pass to Williamson. Here's Ingram. Driving inside. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Looking ahead, they've got the Cavaliers coming to town for their next one. And that's a one-game homestand for the club. Hey, when in doubt, run the defender off the screen. And you know, with a result like that, we'll see them run it again. Especially if the defense is going to allow you to do it. Have to switch on that play. So it's the Pelicans now. After the Warriors picking up a basket just a moment ago. Ingram into the lane. Out of bounds. It'll be Warriors ball. Warriors ball. Thompson, he's checked in for the Warriors. Clay Thompson. Golden State has gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Wiggins finds Bielitsa. Pass to Thompson. Wiggins with it. Five to shoot. That shot, no good. And it's New Orleans taking it the other way. Now Sadoransky. Back to Williamson. And they double up Williamson. Here's Sadoransky. And that one is stopped right through. Nice to see Williamson spot the open man. He has awareness and ability as a passer. Pass to Thompson. Wiseman with it. Here's Kaminga. Right now averaging five and a half a game. Wiggins, no good. The Pelicans trail. Here's Sadoransky. That one's in. Coming off a nice dish from Williamson. Williamson's got three assists in the game. Pass to Thompson. Over Graham. Here's Bielitsa. He's looking good. Two buckets and three attempts. Relentless on the offensive of glass. And then you love the finish. Graham, the pass to Williamson. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. You know, something Zion Williamson was at the forefront of was helping arena workers affected by the COVID pandemic. He set an unbelievable example with his generosity. First one falls for him. And you're referring to Zion's pledge to pay the salaries of so many workers furloughed during that trying time. NBA Zion's effort led to a lot of other NBA players following suit. It was great to see just how much NBA players care about their communities and the people behind the scenes. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Getting themselves to the line this quarter is a good way to get their offense rolling. Time called here. The Warriors decide to talk it over. It's T-shirt time! Oh. 
Golden State has gone 0 for 4 from beyond the arc here in the second quarter. Pass to Kaminga. Thompson gets a good look. Ooh, a little luck that time as it drops. Thompson's got five points now this quarter. Trust Clay Thompson every time with the catch and shoot. He gets so well positioned and balanced to score. Good work there as it goes. And despite the defender's length, he goes right up from the mid-range. And you know what? There was probably a better matchup on the floor, but when it goes in, nobody complains. Now here's Bielitsa. Out to Thompson. Beyond the arc. Kept alive. Nice shot by Kuminga. And the Warriors lead by eight. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. 133 left in the second period. Now here's Hayes. He's been productive, averaging just over seven points a game. Just enough of a shot contest to bother him. Pass to Bielitsa. All this means is he has to be careful. Don't want to pick up a cheapie and get sent to the bench with three fouls. And the Warriors making a change here. Looney's checked in. Kevon Looney. From the inbound. And the slam dunk by Thompson. It only takes a few shots to get Clay Thompson going. A downright incredible score. Pass to Alexander Walker. There's 53 seconds left to play in the first half. Here's Murphy, hounded by Wiggins. Shot clock at six. Here's Alexander Walker. And he gets it back. Hustle points count just like any others. That's a great play. The Warriors leading. Wiggins outside. Pass to Kaminga. Thompson outside. No good on the triple. And <laughs> just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. And here's Graham. A 17-point game for him in the win against Phoenix. And he lobs it up to the rim. Oh, the dunk by Williamson. This is why Williamson's teammates love him. He makes them look good on these alley-oops. Here's Thompson. And so it's the Golden State Warriors leading by six as we wrap up the quarter. Getting lots of great looks, shooting it well. That's why they're up. All right, stick around. We'll be right back after this. And if you're just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. One of the stories here, Clay Thompson. Man, is he getting it done today. Through the first two quarters, he's been on fire. Explosive offensive performance. This is his challenge, to continue to dominate, to help them try to close strong here in the second half. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Kick it off the second half. Here's Steve Kerr's five. The core of the dynasty all out there. Splash Brothers in the backcourt with Draymond at four. James Wiseman is out there with Andrew Wiggins. It gives your offense yet another option when your two-guard Clay Thompson can play inside and be physical. Pass to Williamson. Back to Sadoransky. That's good. And it's Williamson with the assist. Sadoransky's got six. Even against contact, Sadoransky stays agile and just plays right through it. Now Green. Now Curry. Wiggins with it. Let's the three fly. Oh, almost had a four-point play right there. But he'll go to the line with a chance for three. You know, not the smartest play a defender can make there. And the defense of Wiggins, Grant. Something that he's turned around in his career. Yeah, you know, B.A., he went from a weak defender to a strong one. He's always he had sucks. the tools, but he's three putting shots. it all together and can now be a lockdown wing. The 
free throw drops for Wiggins. And the second free throw is good. And he can't make it three for three. The Pelicans trail. Sadoransky outside. Second half of basketball, just over a minute played so far. Here's Williamson. Back to Ingram. No one near him. That's good. And it's Williamson with the assist. Ingram's got 14 points. What I like about Ingram at this point in his career, very decisive in his actions. He shoots it. No good. A bit long that time. Easy chance for mid-range. Wouldn't be surprised to see them run that play again. He's a go-to guy for them because he's that consistent. Time and time again, he delivers. Now here's Wiggins. He's got seven. Pass to Thompson. Now Curry. From deep three-point range. From beyond the arc and then some. For three. He's got 12. Stephen Curry, as soon as he crosses the half-court line, he's in range. Graham with it. Green picks him up. Wiseman with a steal. In transition, here come the Warriors. Wiggins against Ingram. And the bucket counts. And he is on his way to the line. He'll try to make it a three-point play. Hernan Gomez has checked in for the Pelicans. Andrew Wiggins. Shooting one. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Pass to Valentunas. Now Ingram, pounded by Wiggins. The shot by Ingram, no good. That's the shot you hope for, right at the rim. Just couldn't capitalize. And here's Thompson for three. Fires in the triple. Thompson's got five points now in the quarter. Firing on all cylinders here in the third. Only one miss in five attempts. Here's Sadoransky. Yep, that one's good. Golden State has gone two for two from deep here in the third. Graham against Curry. Going inside. Count it. Curry's got 14. The versatility of Curry in the pick and roll. He can make a play for himself, the roller, or someone else on the perimeter. Now here's Graham. He's got five. Ingram with the ball. Green picks him up. Graham against Wiseman. Ooh, rejected by Wiseman. And that's out of bounds. New Orleans will retain possession. And we've got to see that sensational mobile one block again. Yeah, just some terrific effort there. And you know the whole team will get an energy boost off a block like that one. Temple's checked in for Sadoransky. And Golden State also making a switch. Porter Jr.'s checked in. A good look from Graham. And that one's on target from the wing. Graham's got his third basket of the night. The defense late to react. A beautiful play we just saw. Pass to Thompson. 
That drops, and it comes off an assist from Curry. Curry's got nine assists now tonight. Nice little adjustment by Clay in the face of heavy pressure. Now here's Hernan Gomez. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Now here's Ingram. He's guarded by Porter. Outside Graham. Just five on the clock. And it's cleared by Stephen Curry. The Warriors have gone six of seven and appearing confident in this half. Porter's shot is off. For New Orleans, they've gotten five of eight shots to go in the third. Here's Temple. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. That's his first personal foul. First All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Warriors? Anytime you get as many points from the paint as they have, you know you've got a good thing going. You know what else? They never seem to get cold from mid-range tonight. Just keep hitting those jumpers. And he makes a first. Both good from the line that time. Well, with the 2010s in the books, let me put you on the spot here, Smitty. Who is your player of the decade, Stefan or LeBron? Well, Steph changed how our game is played, B.A., plus the two MVPs and three rings. Wow. But I have to go with LeBron James. Swan in eight straight NBA finals. That's crazy. Bielitsa has checked in for Wiseman. And the Pelicans call time here. For New Orleans, they've gotten five of eight shots to go in the third. Pass to Hernan Gomez. And here's Ingram. Back to Hernan Gomez. That one's good on the sweet setup by Ingram. Hernan Gomez has gotten his first bucket of the night. The Warriors leading. Thompson passes to Green. It's deflected. You see the length of Valanciunas on display with that block. Just went up and got it. And so it's New Orleans with it. Outside Graham. You have to be accurate there. Very little room for error passing on the interior. The Warriors have gone 7 of 10 here in the second half. Outside, Green. And he lobs it up top. And the rebound goes to the Pelicans. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touched by Ingram. Some changes for New Orleans. Hayes comes in for Valanchunas. And it's Alexander Walker in for Graham. Golden State has gone two of three from outside so far in the third quarter. On the wing, Thompson for three. Rebounded by New Orleans. Hernan Gomez has got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Ingram. He gets it to go again. Nine for 13 so far. 
Great competitive play from Ingram tonight, and his teammates are sharing in his excitement. It's been fun watching Brandon Ingram's scoring stats climb. He's a guy who can really fill it up, whether he's inside or outside of the arc. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. Here's Temple. The elites are defending. And that one's good. Temple. And now just a five-point Warrior lead. You know, Grant, what's really impressive about Ingram scoring is what he can do on those nights when he just goes off. <laughs> yeah, we've seen some explosive stuff from him on the offensive end from time to time. Now, when he's dialed in, he can absolutely torture you. You just wish he could perform at that level every night. And again, no good by Golden State. Here's New Orleans now. They're on a 14-6 run. Here's Ingram. Oh, they find the hot hand. You can count it. He's 10 for 14 now. Taking things into his own hands this quarter, trying to keep his team afloat. To the paint. Here's Porter. Some solid defense from Ingram. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the boards. Pass to Hayes. Now here's Ingram. Back to Hayes. Five on the clock. Here's Temple. Oh, that doesn't go on the chance to tie. Up ahead. Outside for Porter. Curry with it. Pass to Toscano. Takes the three. And it's good. One. Assisting on the play was Curry. Curry's got ten assists here tonight. So active. New Orleans calls timeout. And as we head into this break, the players have an opportunity to replenish their energy with Gatorade as they prepare to go into the final stages of this ballgame. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, not to mention over the course of a season, you have to stay hydrated. If you don't, it's amazing how much slower your body is to bounce back. It can have a serious effect on performance, no question. Checked in for the Warriors. Kaminga comes in for Porter Jr. The Pelicans trail. Left side, Graham. From down in the low post, it goes. Graham's got nine. Allowing any room to operate, you know he's going to be aggressive. Here's Kaminga. And the layup is good off the glass. And the Warriors lead by six. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. Pass to Hernan Gomez. Here's Alexander Walker. Takes it inside. He gets it in there. 13 points in the game. Soft defense. I mean, they've given up 10 of the last 12 points inside. Golden State has gone three of seven from deep so far in the third quarter. Here's Toscano. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Curry. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. You know what? They talked about this at halftime, and they're doing a better job of creating space. In transition, here come the Warriors. The three from Curry. Another three for Golden State. His third triple of the game. A little more success from out there in the second half. Graham, the pass to Hayes. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. They have no answer defensively inside. The Warriors shooting at around 60% on this one. Very efficient. Outside Curry. Over Graham. That's good from Curry. On the assist by Thompson. Curry's got 19 points. 
He's going off this quarter. A huge reason why this team is on top. Graham up top. He's defended by Looney. And it's blocked. And as it goes out of bounds, New Orleans will keep possession. The Pelicans making a switch here. Williamson's checked in. Wiggins, he's checked in for the Warriors. Outside Graham. Pass to Alexander Walker. Six to shoot. Jacks up a three. Called in by Curry. Curry's got a rebound number five here tonight. Here's Kaminga. And it's good. Jonathan Assisting on the play was Curry. Kaminga's gotten four this quarter. Not just selling for something along the perimeter. Excellent job. Floats one. Here's Graham. And it's Stephen Curry with the rebound. Curry's got six rebounds in the game. Pass to Toscano. Wiggins outside. Outside Curry. Hayes against Wiggins. Over Hayes. Wiggins no good. New Orleans has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Here's Graham. Williamson with it. And it's good for two. Williamson's got 14. We talk about Zion strength, but the body control is also elite, especially for a guy his size. Now here's Wiggins. Ten points for him. Oh, and a fast break for the Pelicans. Here's Alexander Walker. The rebound by Wiggins. Here's Kaminga. The kick out to Wiggins. Looney high post over Hayes. And again, it's the Warriors missing. A little hesitant. Maybe he thought the D was tighter on him than it really was. Well, through three quarters of play, down double digits. It may be difficult to overcome. The Warriors on top. They're up by 10. And coming up as soon as we return from break, the fourth quarter gets underway. And let's take this opportunity to show you our State Farm assist to the game. <laughs> yeah, just shredding the defense with that feed. Zero chance to stop that. Creating plays for others. It's an art form, but it's also a discipline. Fantastic job. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth quarter. Zion and Hayes together down low. Thomas Sadaransky is out there with Devontae Graham. So that's the group out there for New Orleans. Now here's Sadaransky. Pass to Graham. Launches a three. And he can't get that one. The Warriors go the other way with it. It's blocked. Williamson oh a denial and out of bounds New Orleans will have it Valanchunas he's checked in for the Pelicans Pelicans shooting around 59%. They've been outstanding on the offensive end. Here's Murphy. Outside Graham. Drives to the hoop. Pass to Murphy. Now here's Williamson. Here's Graham. No good off the back of the rim. Not his best night, and not the team's best night. Sometimes it just goes that way. Wiggins, no good. 
His inability to make shots has not brought this team down. That shows you their resourcefulness. Coming out of halftime, he wanted to start strong, yet the opposite happened. Here's Kaminga. Valanchunas covering. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. That's on Jonas Valanchunas. First team foul. At the line for the Warriors, Jonathan Kaminga. At the line for two. Shooting two. That free throw misses. Green's checked in for the Warriors. So neither attempt will fall that time for him. The Pelicans have got none of their shots to go in this final quarter. 0 for 4. We haven't seen many buckets like that one. These teams have struggled to dial in their shooting. You have to give credit to the defenses. Protecting the rim. Closing out hard. This one's been a grind. And here's Curry for 3. Score it. 13 shots, 9 makes. Solid. Talking about heating up. At halftime, he had just one made from beyond the arc. But he's drained 3 more since. Pass to Sadoransky. Here's Graham. Launches it. The Warriors pull it in. Green's got four rebounds now. Wiggins outside. Outside, Green. Curry draws the double to the middle. Here's Wiseman. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. Shot's good. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. I mean, that was just terrific work to stay in control and finish. And the Pelicans making a change here. Ingram's checked in. And Golden State also making a switch. Porter Jr.'s checked in. Just over two and a half minutes played now. Final quarter of regulation. Pass to Sadoransky. Williamson against Green. And the foul called on Draymond Green. That's his first foul of the game. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. Graham with it. Shoots over Wiseman. Ooh, rejected by Wiseman. I don't know how many shots he's missed this quarter, but they're going to have to find offense from someone else. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Well, throughout the career of Otto Porter Jr., he became a very strong outside shooter, Smitty. It took him three years in this league to become a three-point threat. Since then, though, he's been fantastic, B.A. Career average hovers right around 40 percent take a break take a break two shots and that one misses the third overall pick in 2013 porter's gotten the big contract he's been traded he's had a lot going on early in his career He hits the second from the line. Just about three minutes through the fourth and final quarter here. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. 
Back to Sadoransky. Pass to Valentunas. Just five to shoot. And that's a foul called on Stephen Curry. That's his first foul. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. A bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Sadoransky with it. Guarded now by Wiseman. And he lobs it up. And it's Wiseman with the jam. Good work by Curry moving the ball. He has a good eye for those openings. Sadoransky outside. Curry against Graham. Ooh, nothing falling for them right now. Golden State has gone one for two from deep in this fourth quarter. Inside. Curry draws the double. And it's going to be a three-second three call. Second violation. Ball. New Orleans has gone 0 for 3 here in the fourth. Pass to Williamson. Back to Graham. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. And the Warriors making a change here. Thompson's checked in. Personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for your Pelicans, Devontae Graham. At the line for one. I mean, Zion hit the ground running when he first got into the league. He went from the first pick overall in 2019 to an all-star in no time flat. Now here's Curry. There's the three. Sadoransky pulls it in. Uncontested look. Can't fault the shot selection. He's money from there. Pass to Ingram. Basket's good on the assist from Sadoransky. Ingram's got 25 points in the game. Smitty, when you think about the rapid ascension of Zion Williamson, you also see his improvement clearly in his stat line. That's right. He's taking and hitting more outside shots, playing with terrific physicality, and that will make your numbers go up across the line. Here's Graham following the score by Golden State. And that's a foul called on Stephen Curry. That's foul number two for him. And that puts them just one foul from the bonus. Here's Graham. Pass to Sadoransky. Now Graham. Clock at six. And he's going for the oop here. It's stolen by Green. You know, when you're trailing, you can't afford mistakes. And he's made a few of them tonight. It's good. Wiseman's got nine points now in the quarter. The beauty of Draymond as a facilitator really sees the entire floor. Pass to Ingram. And here's Valanciunas. There's the double with Thompson. Sadoransky outside. Pelicans keep it alive. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Man, he keeps doing his part. They just haven't been able to get over the hump. Down low. Here's Green. Nice D from Valanciunas. New Orleans has gotten just one of their four threes to go here in the fourth quarter. Graham against Curry. Pass to Williamson. And here's Ingram. He's guarded by Porter. Ingram, the pass to Graham, over Green. Oh, he clanks that one off the back iron, and it falls. Graham's got nine points now in the second half. And the Warriors with possession here. 17 points was their biggest margin. Porter, the pass to Thompson. No good with the triple. And New Orleans shooting just 38% here in the fourth. Sadoransky outside. Oh, 
Oh, he gets it to fall, and that makes it just a single-digit deficit. Uh, get some style points there. Pretty finish. Timeout, timeout. timeout called. The Warriors. There's no way Coach likes this effort level. They need to refocus. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. Time now to present our New Balance Player of the Game, Stephen Curry. And what's impressed me is how he's distributed the rock. I mean, he clearly wants to make his guys better. This kind of selfless attitude really improves overall team chemistry. I'm telling you, the added pressure of the road really brings out the best in him. You can tell he enjoyed playing so well in front of an unfriendly crowd. Gives us a chance to catch up with Allie LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Steve Kerr had to say to the team. He likes what he's seeing, but he cautioned his players, we are not far enough ahead to assume anything. Momentum can shift in a heartbeat. We have to be diligent, and we have to be smart. All right, Allie, thanks once again. And here are the Pelicans now. The Warriors getting their last shot to go. And it's Ingram off the drive. Ooh, rejected by Wiseman. Thompson passes to Green. Curry with it. Graham covering. Out to Thompson. The three. Zion Williamson grabs the miss. Williamson's got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Pass to Ingram. Now here's Graham. Williamson with it. Let's it fly. Shoots over Thompson. Williamson with the bucket. Williamson's gotten four this quarter. And coming down the stretch, both teams still playing fantastic offense. Yes, and if you love offense, you're loving this matchup. It's been a highlight reel affair. The Pelicans have gotten seven of 16 attempts to drop since the start of the fourth. Outside Graham. Over Thompson. And so ball out of bounds. Thompson touched it last. So it's the Pelicans now. They trail by nine. Ingram. Here's Hernan Gomez. Oh, persistence pays off as they finally hit a shot. <laughs> They're really working the paint now. The Warriors have gotten six of their 13 shots to go. Williamson against Green. Wiggins outside. The three from Curry. The Pelicans pull it in. <laughs> and I'm surprised that didn't go down. I mean, I'm sure he is, too. Ram for three. They get it again. Oh, the bucket's good, and he'll have a chance at one more. It's going to go on Draymond Green. Yeah, you can tell they're trying for high percentage looks here in the second half. A strategy they hope will help them close ground. That's his second personal foul. 15 foul. At the line for your Pelicans, Billy Shooting one. And they've done well from the free throw line this half. No misses yet. The Warriors leading. Golden State calls timeout. Coach definitely wants to talk about their interior defense, which has not been impressive. It's a matter of want to. 
helping out contested shots. You have to want to make the effort. Here's Thompson. Pass to Curry. They double team Curry. Now Wiggins. Six on the shot clock. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. And the Warriors lead by six. In crunch time, trying to get the foul, timeout, the timeout. bucket, or both. New Orleans calls timeout. Man, it's been quite a game for Stephen Curry. You have to make it harder for him to score. Deny the ball, even double, whatever it takes to force someone else to beat you. Here's Williamson, and they double up Williamson. And he's going for the lob! Oh, the dunk by Williamson! Big one! Coach feels comfortable going to Zion when it matters. The Warriors have gone 7 for 15 in the fourth. Curry against Graham. And it's Stephen Curry with the three. Curry's got 25 points. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Pass to Toscano. Sadaransky with the steal. Oh, and a fast break for the Pelicans. Ram for three. Williamson, great positioning on the putback. A competitive fight with a putback by Zion. Defense couldn't box him out. with it and it's Graham picking him up Curry draws the double it's Thompson high post fires top of the key and all around the rim that time before dropping Thompson's got 11 points here in the second half Thompson has one of the sweetest strokes in the game pass to Williamson shot from 16 and another basket for New Orleans Competitive, confident, Zion taking over. Curry draws the double. Here's Toscano, covered by Williamson. Graham against Curry. Fires from deep. Sadoransky pulls it in. To the inside. Count it! What a beautiful shot! Brings it within three! This is where Zion's most dangerous. Out in the open floor, getting set up for the finish. Curry draws the double. 
Wiggins for three. And it's good. Oh, Assisting on the play out. was Curry. Stepping up in a big way. Woo! It's great to see Wiggins take and make these huge shots. New Orleans calls timeout. They're trailing by six. 26 seconds left in the fourth. Seconds separating the shot clock and the game clock. Ram for three. Up again. It's good on the putback. I love how efficient Zion is. Dependable at picking smart shots to take. And the Warriors call time here. They're ahead by four. 19 seconds left in the fourth. Nineteen seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. And they commit an intentional foul. We'll see another one of those, so they get into the penalty. Getting a little desperate at this stage. I mean, the clock's the big factor. And now we've got an intentional foul. Jonas Valanciunas. That's his fifth personal foul. Fifth team foul. Shooting for Golden State, Stephen Curry. At the line for two. Shooting two. He drops the first one, and that puts him up five. When you think of Curry, his shooting is what comes to mind always, specifically how quick his release is. And so he drops them both, and it's a six-point ball game making the most of his trip to the line and helping them extend their lead. And they've been moving the ball really well tonight. Good things come to those who take good shots. Offensive versatility so important at the NBA level. As an amateur, Zion could just overpower people. And they foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. Yeah, and there's no question they have to foul. Now, I'm sure they would have preferred to avoid it. Taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Good on the first. And that gives him a four-point cushion. People say Klay Thompson's shooting form is picture perfect, and they're not wrong. Key is out there. Watch how he shoots it and take notes. And so both free throws good. And it's a five-point game. There's the knockout blow. No chance of getting up off the canvas now. Outside Ingram. 
Offensive rebound. It falls! Yeah, he's shown he can get it done in the big moments. JV delivering in the clutch. And they're going to prolong the game with an intentional foul. That's his second personal foul. Shooting for Golden State. Clay Thompson. Two shots. First one drops, and that gives him a four-point cushion. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a five-point game. And so the Warriors take the win. And they barely squeezed out the win here on the road. And B.A., the visiting team is always under some added pressure. But they made it work and got the win, whatever the margin may have been. And now we have Allie LaForce standing with the player of the game. Allie, take it away. Stefan, plenty of momentum swings in this game. What made the difference in the end? Because everybody was on. Uh, defensively, it was a tough night on both sides, just trying to contain and fire around and try to contest shots. But at the end of the day, we made a couple more plays, kept our composure on the stretch, and got the win. It's a beautiful thing when shots are falling. Thanks, Devin. All right, Allie, thank you. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. So for Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson, thanking everyone for watching tonight's game. We'll see you next time.